As part of National Dental Hygiene Month, the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs recently hosted a pivotal workshop for dental practitioners aimed at refining strategies to improve oral health services across St. Lucia. This initiative aligns with the Ministry's commitment to achieving the World Health Organization's goals for oral health, ensuring that dental health services are better integrated and accessible to all. Dr. Sherry Frame Lecourt, senior medical surgeon in the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs, explained the workshop's purpose. Here we are today. I have brought the team together so that we can review the plan that WHO has, review what our approach has been over the years, and to try and sync it to ensure that we have a very sustainable and effective approach to ensuring better oral health for the public. The workshop delved into critical integration of oral health within primary healthcare systems, intensified efforts to combat antimicrobial resistance, and fostered collaboration with departments tackling non-communicable diseases and ensuring a comprehensive and unified approach to enhancing public health outcomes. Dr. Ephraim Lecourt further emphasized the critical health between oral health and overall well-being. Persons with poor oral health, they have an increase in the bacterial load in their mouth, which sometimes the, these toxins get into the bloodstream and it impacts on the, the pancreas and the insulin. And so even if you were to be taking your diabetes medication it, and you're not seeing an effective change, it could be that it is being impacted by probably some toxins that in your mouth. So that is why we always encourage doctors to at least do a cursory glance of their patient's mouth to see whether or not their oral health is good or it's poor, that they can refer them, if it's not good, to our dental services to help improve. Because we look at human beings as a holistic being. Through workshops like this, the Ministry of Health continues to make strides to improve oral health across St. Lucia while empowering dental practitioners to play a pivotal role in the country's healthcare strategy. There's so many ideas coming out of this program. Um, I would hope that we'd be able to do all of them. It's tough because you know the staff complement is not very large, but everybody is excited about what can I do in my capacity as a hygienist, as a therapist, as a dentist, as a dental assistant. So that is what we're doing there right now. From the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs, Chevroy Marius.